Hi, it's Jordan with FlexiJet and I want to show you what it looks like to measure an existing countertop for replacement using the FlexiJet 3D. So FlexiJet has a number of features built in that make this easy and accurate and save us time on the job sites. So first thing I'm going to do is auto level my FlexiJet. I'm going to do that right from the screen of my tablet. and So I'm going to click that single button, auto level, and it's an instant auto leveling. Now I'm going to let it know that I'm measuring countertops. So countertop button, I have the option to name this if I'd like. I'm going to go ahead and set my plane with that single point. So I can do that right from the FlexiJet head unit here. I'll just aim it at the countertop surface and measure that point. So I can now go ahead and start measuring my surfaces. So I'm going to start at the far end here, choose my multiple lines command, and start measuring my way across here. I've got uh, two aluminum targets set up on the end there. I'll work my way around the front of this countertop. Notice I don't need any tape or anything to capture those points. Um, so I don't have to go around and set those up and work my way through the stove opening in here as well. So as I work my way to the back, I now have this great feature built right into the FlexiJet that lets me auto fillet those pieces together. So I'll hit that button right on the screen of my FlexiJet and now I'll keep measuring on my other half of my kitchen here. So again using my multiple lines function, grab two points to grab my stove opening here and then work my way through the front edges of this countertop. We'll go ahead and grab two points right through there. And then I'll grab two points on this front edge as well. And then I'm going to grab, it's a little tough to see on the angle of the camera. In fact, you may not be able to see around there. But I'm going to grab two points on the inside of this panel. And uh, then I will auto fill it those together. So I've got that put together right from my screen here. Again, a single click for auto fill it. And you'll see those join together. Um, this is one of the where the laser technology of the FlexiJet really sets it apart. So I've got a kind of a semi-gloss backsplash here. I'm going to go ahead and measure that right from the FlexiJet though. So I'm going to measure uh, a point on each tile just to make sure that if that wall moves in or out, I'm compensating for that. So I'm working my way across these tiles. Again, I don't need any uh, tape or any other aids like that to, to measure these. So an efficient way for us to measure here. And I'll work my way around this back wall as well here, grabbing again a point on each tile just for a little bit of extra information here, make sure that we've got a nice tight fit. And so those are put together. I'm going to grab that, uh, that back wall there and when I get to the end I'm actually going to measure a couple uh, data points on the wall past it as well and that's going to help me determine the thickness of my tile as well. So I've measured to the end of the tile, I'm just going to grab a measurement point here and take that on the drywall. That's going to let me know exactly how thick those are, so where I need to offset that. Um, so I'm going to walk you through a little bit of the editing steps that we might take here. I'm going to go ahead and square this out. Uh, to do that, I'm going to go ahead and give myself a red line and just draw it across the stove opening so I can see that nice and square. And then I'm going to use my line tool, single click to align to that. Just delete my red line. So what I'd like to determine now is exactly how thick that backsplash is. So to do that, I'm going to use my vertical dimension tool, click from the last point that I measured on the backsplash uh, to that point that I measured on the drywall. You'll see it's about 7 16 inch thick backsplash there. So that's uh, really helpful for me to see that right away at a glance. So what I'm going to do before I connect these together is I'm just going to offset those back by uh, 3 eighths of an inch there to compensate for that thickness and I've made those in red just so I can see clearly which one of my lines is which. So again using my, my tools here I'm going to go ahead and connect these corners together. Connect this bottom corner as well. Again just using my fingers here with the touch commands of the uh, FlexiJet Stone software and we'll work these through as well. So one of the beautiful things about FlexiJet of course is we have the ability to verify some of these points. Um, by projecting them out. So if I'm looking at my drawing here on the page, um, you know, a, a great point for me to check might be this one right next to the stove here. So I'm going to go ahead and fl ask FlexiJet to show me that point, make sure that I move out of the way so that it can, so that we can see that on the camera as well. So just click on the software, FlexiJet, show CAD point, click on that point and you'll see FlexiJet moves its laser and it's going to point it right to that point so that I can see exactly what I measured is what uh, is transferred into the software here. Likewise, I'll just check this other point as well. 
and you'll see FlexiJet moves all on its own and it points back straight to this corner. It's hitting just the corner there exactly so I can see exactly what uh, I measured is what's on the page here. Um, one more feature I want to show you here and again this is uh, because FlexiJet has a camera built in so with the measurement head here we have a camera built in next to the laser um, and this lets us capture a picture of every single point that we measure. So for example if we want to see uh, you know this point here let's see what it looks like on the backslash make sure I got that right of the tile. How have a quick view and see that yes that's exactly what I measured there it's on the outside there I'm confident in how that looks so thanks so much for watching we'd love to do an interactive online demo with you where you can control the FlexiJet and see for yourself how FlexiJet's next generation technology makes measuring easy and accurate